Ladies and gentlemen, you thought we were done? Not even close. Welcome back, number so <laughs> Welcome back to another Thursday, guys. My name is Weepy. I hope you're all having a great day. Today, we're going to be doing which Minecraft mob is the best builder, part two. If you haven't seen part one, I recommend uh, finding it. It was only posted a week ago, so it should be easy to find. Unless you're watching this in the future, so hello. This is for me from the past. In the past video, we concluded that these six mobs, the horse, the Endermite, the Silverfish, the Evoker, Villager, and the Fox were the smartest. Where's the Polar Bear? I, I just lost the Polar Bear. All right. These seven mobs, the Polar Bear, Horse, Endermite, Silverfish, Evoker, Villager, and Fox are the smartest mobs when it comes to building. They have the best building sense in the whole game. Now, we have a few of them up here, but a few of them also died. So, yeah. Today's building test will be as such. They are given this block palette. This red wool has to be replaced with the block that best fits the palette. They have the options of endstone, gold ore, or prismarine. The palette theme is ocean monument. So yeah, Mr. Polar Bear. It's really simple. It, it's really quite simple. I, I believe in you, my friend. This is the block palette. You must choose a block to replace the red wool that fits the palette the best. Begin. And they'll give you an opening because you're fat. So yeah, no pressure. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, oops, one, and I'm kind of just not even paying attention to the poor polar bear, but it looks like he could not come to a conclusion, which means, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, but it looks like he just not fit to be a builder, buddy. Mr. Horse, look at this block palette. This red wool has to be replaced by the most appropriate block to the theme of Ocean Monument. Choose wisely. Ugh, it's another fat mob. I gotta... Wait, he grew up! He used to be a baby! Ah. In that case... Well, it's death or life, my friend. You're gonna have to pick which way you think is best. Can horses fit through on block gaps? They definitely can. I think they can pathfind through on block gaps. If you don't choose in one minute, you will be killed. That means wheat, yeet, thweet, and bweet. And you are dead, Mr. Horse. It is time for the next competitor. Let's just remove the horse spawn egg and the polar bear spawn egg. Mr. Silverfish, this block palette has a theme of ocean monument. You must choose the correct replacement for the red block. And begin. Slow fall is amazing. Ooh, he goes right for the end stone. Are you sure? Oh, nope, okay. Okay, he goes for the prismarine. That's a good choice. Oh, nope, he goes out. Okay, yeah, take your time, take your time. At least you're making a decision. Ooh, he's, he has no idea. He's checking out all the possible options. Which one looks right to him? Oh, he's going for that one. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, okay, here, I'll give you a... You change your mind. Here, okay. You go for that one. Five, he settled. For nope, okay, all right. Then this guy has no. He has like he cannot decide for the life of him. Five, four, three, two, one. He has chosen endstone. I can see where you're coming from. Looks like a pretty fitting block to me. But regretfully, silverfish, that is not the correct answer. Big rip, my friend. But that was just not correct. The silverfish did not pass. He fell from the sky. 
I forgot. I, I forgot the slow fall. Oh no! I'm so sorry, Mr. Endermite. Uh, this block palette has the theme of Ocean Temple. You must choose the correct block that is the closest to the other three to replace the red wool. And begin. Oh, we're going right for the end stone, just like the silverfish. First instinct, I see you. Is that your final decision? You have five seconds. Four seconds. Three seconds. Two seconds. One second. It looks like he went for the end stone, which as we all know, is the incorrect answer. I am so sorry. Moving up is the really weird old pillager, I mean evoker man. So you're gonna have to go in. I don't think you'll die. You definitely won't. Okay, good. And now, my boy, or weird old man, this block palette has the theme of Ocean Temple. You must choose the correct block to replace the red wool as shown by the three examples. Best of luck to you. Weirdo. Let's grab the other two. Because they were killed mercilessly. Ooh, he goes for the end stone. Is that your final decision? Why is everyone going for the end stone, man? Is that your final decision? It is five, four, three, two. Oh, I see you. For the prismarine, are you going to go through? He is. Five, four, three, two, one. He passed. Mr. Evoker, you absolute legend. You have passed. Very good building instinct. What a god. Very well done. Next up, Mr. Fox. Mr. F oh, ha, ha. Mr. Fox. This is the Sea Temple theme. You must choose the best block to replace the red wool to match the other three for the theme Sea Temple. Best of luck to you. Adorable little baby. I love foxes. They're the cutest mob in the game, I swear. Go for the goal, or Five. Okay. Final choice. This is your final choice. Five. Four. Or not. Okay. That's your final choice. Or, or, or not, he seems to be deciding between these two options. Oh, he's settled. Five, four, three. Mr. Fox, oh, so cute. I'm so, I am feel so bad. Two, one. I'm so sorry. I can't, I can't do it. I can't. <laughs> he's so adorable. I can't bring my, I'm sorry. You, you, nah, leave. It, it's. You you lost. You picked wrong. It was the wrong answer. I'm so yeah. I'm so sorry. You can live. I Oh, how can you kill that? How? This is so sad. Oh, you can't you can't harm him. He's too pure. And now it's just up to the villager. Villager versus pillager or versus evoker, whatever. Mr. Villager. This has the theme Ocean Monument. You must choose the correct block to replace the red wool that fits the palette the best. Best of luck to you. Oh, he's so cute. He chose the end stone. So many people are choosing the end stone. Five seconds. Four seconds. Three, he left. Chose the prismarine. Five. Or, uh, 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 uh. Will you go in? You gotta go in. He's staring at it. He's making sure if it makes sense. He's going for the gold. He's gonna look at the gold. Or he's gonna look at me. Okay, okay, I see how it is. Going for the end stone again. The previous choice. Five. Four. Three. Two. Oh, he's leaving. Okay, back to the gold. Okay, I can see how gold will be confusing, because gold does match with gold ore. But remember, the theme is Ocean Monument. Which of the top blocks is best suited for Ocean Monument? And that seemed to convince him it was Endstone. Five, four, three, two, one. He has made his decision. Which means... The winner, the best builder mob in Minecraft, is the Evoker. I was going to say Pillager. Mr. Evoker, congratulations. You have won the contest. The Evoker is the best builder in all of Minecraft. It is concluded. 
thank you all so much for watching this video. If you have enjoyed, then be sure to leave a like and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And yeah, uh, thank you again once so much for watching, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace out. Oh, it's so. This is literally the best thing in the whole world, I swear.